Hi and welcome to this uh, tutorial on um, how to get started in going live. Um, the first thing that you'll do is go to the top right, click in here, go to your Creator Studio, and uh, once you're in your Creator Studio, then go over to where it says Live Streaming and go into stream now and then get started. Uh, you'll also notice here that it'll, it tells you that you won't be able to stream for 24 hours, but you could get set up. And this here, it says when you start streaming, this is going to be where your um, your fans can find you is in here, or your subscribers is to click that and to go into a notebook or any other type of um, type of um, notepad or something that you have for information to save that information, and then to click on Get Started. to see a page like this well. Okay. If that's something to do, you can hope potentially an appropriate message for read message in you and you want to turn that on. Okay. Um, a couple things here. First, this is your screen name key, and when you click on here, and you you can see it, but you don't want anybody else to see it because then they'll be able to stream on your channel, and you don't want that. This is the server information right there. Okay, uh, this is your um, basic information that you want to use uh, for your channel. And I am just going to um, use information that I've already been using. So just to, to get it started here, the Facebook Barter and Swap Networking uh, live stream. Just add this in the description. Okay, that's not, not what I meant to do. Because I had already that information. I don't want that. Anyways, the, that's my title there, and I wanted to copy this and to basically put this in my because this is my new channel, the Facebook Fire Swap DIY Networking Group. So, whatever information you want to put in here. Okay? and the category, people and blogs, and the privacy, whether you want it to be private, public, or you have a choice here, unlisted or private. Mine is public. This is your setup. This information is already here. So you don't need to worry about that. If you want to uh, change your thumbnail, 
This is much that I have here, and it's sticking a little bit on, on me. Sorry. You could also change your thumbnail just by clicking in here. Where it says change your thumbnail and going into your pictures or wherever you keep your information of pictures that you would like to use. Or okay. I just chose that one, so now the thumbnail is going to come right there. So even when it's offline, it's it's you should have a picture right, right there. So this is the picture that's gonna come up. That's my thumbnail. Um, um, two other things to uh, to think about too is when you are setting up, you can decide. On uh, where you want to have your stuff. If you want to have your box, or if you want to move your box, down to the or change it spot here. So, boxes with these little buttons are down your box, and you can move it up now. whatever you want to do. Okay, so basically we do have this now um, set up. The next thing we want to do is we want to go into events. Okay, I don't have any events scheduled in here right now. So, I'm going to uh, schedule a new event. Either schedule a new event or add live event. So, I'm going to schedule a new event. And, and you're going to put your title in here on what it's going to be about um, when is it going to happen so mine is scheduled for the uh, December the 19th that um, it says here 20 hours, but it's actually that's 8 o'clock. And then my description. Now, you want to use a description um, that will use the uh, keywords that you have in here. And, you know, basically how I would do that is I would just go into... Um, one of my videos that I've already done with the information that I already have um, and, and into the actual uh, video into the edit and take this actual information out of here. This is just to me doing this for now because um, I just want to do this a little faster. And I'm just going to put this in here. Okay, I'm also going to take my keywords. And I'm also going to put 
keywords in here as well. Okay, so this is actually setting up the information for um, the event that I'm creating. And I, then um, I just want to take my, oops, sorry, this is my vid I keep coming up here. I don't, don't want happening. I just want to take this information and just, you know, I'm doing this a little bit uh, quicker so that um, I don't, I don't waste your time. But I am trying to um, do this as slow as possible for you to be able to to get it and to get the information and also for some reason that's not working so it's, it's still doing something so I just need to just leave that for a second. Okay, so that is basically how to set up for your event, um, and your event is your your actual going live. Okay, so you can just go, you can have that all done, and then you can go into your advanced settings and make sure that you've got enable your live chat especially if you're doing a question and answer, or if you want people to be able to be interactive with you. Now, the enable the slow mode, that means, you know, if you have quite a few people that will be um, talking to you or asking you questions, then it it's actually slower so that it's not coming one on top of the other, so you're missing the information. And then you can limit the chat post to 60 uh, to post to every 60 seconds per person, which means like if a person is doing something in chat, then it uh, they're asking you a question. You can limit it to 60, or you can limit it to uh, 30, and automatically block spam messages. And you can click on this to see what it means by that. Um, so it automatically will block simple spam such as long messages in all caps or repeated identical messages by the same user. My ownership is always creative comments, so I'm just going to check that off. I mean, it's just like doing the information for your video. It's the exact same thing because after you do the live broadcast, YouTube will make it into a video and it will be uploaded to your channel. Promote through cards when event is live. You can put cards on and I'll show you where to put cards. You can um, also promote on your on your channel category, whatever your category is. You could select your language. My language is English. And your recording date, which is going to be um, tomorrow. Users can view ratings for this video. And also here, if you want to viewers to be able to seek back up to four hours while you are streaming. So you can enable this, enable the DVR. And then the normal uh, latency. And then you click create the event. Okay, so now this event is now created. Have all the information here. Now I'm just going to now be 
waiting to hear back from YouTube to make sure that my channel is, uh, that I'm able to um, stream and you're going to be able to find this information by going actually into your channel. Hello, Loki. And into your um, advanced We're already into the place that I wanted to. Um, but actually, now that we're here, I, I wanted to show you another thing. This is your advanced, is where you put your channel keywords. And in order to save them, you have to make sure that you click the save button. And then it will tell you up here whether it was saved. And then if you want to um, add another one, you just say so you would just click in here and uh, you can just add another to your channel and click save. Continue doing that until you've added your keywords that you wanted to add to there. Um, also if you are promoting, um, say, you are promoting an associated website, um, then you're going to add it in here. So just clicking add to that. Now it's going to check it out and re refresh it. And then getting back now into my channel. Okay, so now this is going to tell me what I can do and what I can't do right now, okay? It's going to tell me, yes, you can upload, um, and no, I'm not monetized yet. It can say, yes, you can do live stream streaming. You can also embed live, I, I can't embed live streaming right now, but I can do longer videos. And I can also do um, unlisted and private videos, custom thumbnails, external animations. I believe that's going to be going away. I, I don't have super chat in um, enabled yet because you need to have at least 1,000 subscribers to have that enabled. Um, I'm not eligible for my custom U URL yet on this channel. This is just a new channel. Um, content ID appeals. It lets you appeal rejected content or ID duplicates and you can learn more by clicking there. And also they do have another uh, way that people can make money through channel memberships and the super chat. Uh, that is not enabled on my channel. Okay, and it also tells you here whether you've had any copyright strikes. So this is all very important information to know. So anyways, getting back here into your um, live streaming. Now I hope that I've able to, to I've been able to answer any questions for you. So when you're um, You've got all this done and you're ready. When it comes to um, the time when you're actually ready to, to go live, then what you'll do sorry, I have a lot of ads that come on here sometimes. Well, first of all, I want to unmute that. Let's 
So let's hear it go live. You have to start your encoder. And uh, this is located. Where it says here set up encoding software, so you click on this arrow right here. Um, add stream information, which is already done, your optional features, and then do go, go, go live. options, everything's done. You can add cards if you want to, but this is where I wanted to Now you also have a camera that you can click on. Um, the webcam stream information again. You put your you put your title in. Facebook just to start and here where it says encoder live streaming you click on that see here what it says here at the bottom what's going on it's up right now it's going into your live dashboard And I am not able to go online right now because I um, I haven't got it set. I haven't got this set up with my actual uh, video capture. Okay, so I'm going to end this tutorial right here and um, be looking forward to um, you be able to uh, subscribe and like um, because it's very important to me. Um, one more thing is do you see this information right here? This is what we copied. Okay. You also want to send this out to tell people that you are going to be going live at a certain time to the different social platforms that you have. Okay, so I hope this has been helpful, and uh, good luck. Uh, good luck on your first uh, live uh, broadcast. I hope everything works out, and uh, um, leave me a comment down below. And um, if you have any questions, just uh, send it to me, and if I can answer it, I will. If not, I'll try to find an answer for you. Until then, have yourself a, a, a great night. Bye now.